In occasions, you may choose to merge tickets from a same client. Uh, to make it easier, I've gone ahead and done a quick search by unique contact. And if you notice on my screen, I have two tickets under the name of Jerry Klein. So to make it easier, I'm going to go ahead and merge these two tickets and just continue working with one of them. Now, regardless of this merging process that you'll see in a moment, it doesn't matter what email thread Jerry replies to, all the messages will always be added into what we'll define as the winning ticket, the one that will remain open. So let's go ahead and do the uh, merging process. Now, I'm going to go ahead and pick the most recent ticket, which is the one on top, and it will be merged into the oldest ticket, which is the one at the bottom. So to do that, I'm going to click on the title of the newest ticket. Once inside in the ticket detail view, I'm going to open more actions and then simply select merge. Now notice what happens. Happy Fox immediately identifies all the other tickets under the name of Jerry Klein. That's perfect. That's what I needed. I need to make sure then this ticket gets merged into this other one that is on hold right now. I could add some notes if I wanted, but it's not necessary. I'm going to go ahead and merge the ticket. And immediately, notice that the ticket that we had open, right, has been updated with a closed status, so it becomes the losing ticket. And we have an event recorded in Power of the Audit Trail, which is telling us that this ticket has been merged now with this other one. It provides the hyperlink to the other ticket, so I can easily go back into that ticket. So by clicking on the hyperlink. So now that we are in the ticket that we uh, merged, you'll clearly see the entire audit trail. These are the previous messages back and forth that we had in the older ticket and even the actual record of when we merge the newest ticket and right above the message that came in from the ticket that we merged from. So the entire audit trail from both tickets gets lined up into this one unique ticket that we get to keep working with. It is important again to know that for the end user, in this case, Jerry Klein, it doesn't matter what email threat he picks up. He might reply to both ongoing conversations, yet all those messages will be threaded into the only one remaining ticket. I hope this was helpful. Thanks again for watching.